So here we're given that y is product of x plus 1, x minus 1, and x plus 5, and we're asked to find the derivative of y with respect to x. Now the key thing to notice here is this product, which is the difference of squares. And we're going to do that immediately because that way we only have to differentiate the product of uh, two terms as opposed to three. And I'm not going to multiply this further because we're just going to take the derivative of the product would be easier. I mean, you can certainly do the multiplication, and I'll do that as well. But uh, if you do it this way, it's going to be x squared minus 1 times the uh, derivative of that with respect to x, which is just 1. And then it's x plus 5, and then this d over dx, x squared minus 1, is just 2x. Just easier to do it. Now I'm going to do the expansion because if you look at the answer choices, uh, the terms are all combined. So this is going to be 2x squared plus 10x, and then combine like terms, and I get that, which matches with answer choice C. Now if you chose to multiply it at this stage, I think it's more work, but certainly maybe slightly more. So let's do the multiplication. Maybe not too bad. And then we're going to do the derivative of that. I think if the terms are more involved, might be more work. So this would be 3x squared plus 10x minus 1, which certainly matches with that. So either way, the answer is C.